All right, hello. I am downstairs just putting on some oh, gardening boots, working boots. Um, I'm going to give you an update on how things are going down here. I've just taken off my jumper. It's like really sunny outside, but it's cold. And as you can see behind me, um, things are happening. And I've got a bit of work to do. I'm going to get a bit hot and sweaty. So I know I'm going to warm up, but it's a bit fresh outside at the moment so let me give you a quick update you haven't really seen the downstairs area because i have kept it on the quiet but let me sort of give you a tour through we're now fully closed in so this used to be a tandem garage so you would drive through the front tandem garage all the way to the back and this was a complete wall down the side there so we had like a little entry door through here that was all gates across the back all open it was actually oh my god it's freezing um we actually had those down the side of the house so they've all come off they're going on marketplace to sell that door is going on marketplace to sell but you'd go through that door this is what i'm walking over and then out the back or through the laundry so We've been in demo mode for the past few days. I need to start cleaning though. So I need to get this door taken out so I can sell it uh, and then finish taking out the rest of like all of the gyp rock and starting to do a tidy up. So I thought I would kind of just film it for those that are watching the renovation series. We'll probably get a bit of a kick out of this. Um, the new front door is in. I have a thing on my Instagram showing Right, guys i'm so good at doing this i go to vlog and my camera um literally has a flat battery so i ran upstairs and changed the battery it's too cold i'm putting on a jumper so i'm just going to film we're going to do a big clean out we're actually piling up like timber we've offered because that wall's coming down it's got like all internal studs um and we put a thing on our local market facebook page saying if anyone wants some internal studs they need to have like um the nails taken out of them and the glue from the plaster but if you want them they're there totally free so that saves us a trip to the tip although we have to go to the tip a few times and it helps someone else who potentially wants to do some renovation or building we can offer some free materials so i'm going to chuck you on the tripod and we're going to try and clean clean and organize a little bit we've got electrical work happening next week so this will actually be the downstairs lounge room area stairs we're going up dining eventually i'm going to have a kitchen move down here that's probably a few years away yet being realistic with budget and then in this side of the house when you first walk in there'll be like a mud room laundry toilet and then the walk-in pantry that's the full plan way off but i just want to clean and get all this stuff out so when i've got my tradesmen coming around it's a lot more better i've had no tradesmen for a week and we haven't done a lot down here so i want to get things out and tidied our biggest issue is this has been literally our storage shed and now we're turning it into internal stairs flooring walls we actually don't have anywhere to put this so we did have plans to put a shed down the back of the house down the track we're actually thinking of doing that now and using it for storage because we, we've just got stuff everywhere and we can't get access to it i'm sure some of the stuff has probably been damaged by now so let's try and do a clean up this video is going to be the best clean up i can do in a construction site pretty much so let's go hi let's go Today's forecast, a lot of sunshine, blue skies, marine clouds. Just a perfect day to go outside and relax. That's your forecast. We'll be right back. Yeah, sunny day, sunny day, sunny day. No clouds in the sky, but I get away. Feels like it's been a freaking decade. Sorry, don't call me because I'm gonna be on break. Sunny day, sunny day, make way. All the stress and doubt, yeah, not today. Feels like it's been a freaking decade. Sorry, don't call me because I'm gonna be on break. Got the trap of Fresh car sushi on a platter, brandy honey, it don't matter, shots Till I drop, drop, gonna be 24 7, golden hour like a boss. And they say, yo, guess you got a two o'clock appointment for a champagne shop, oh yeah. I 
I'm busy tryna take it higher Got no time for never Only spending cheddar Wish I could do this forever Chilling with the hottest company They all wanna welcome me To their private penthouse suite Yeah, now I got the key Rooftop pool, got a heli on speed Ocean view from the highest peak I'm complete Oh, I want this to stay Please don't go away yeah. Positivity to this party, don't want no drama with any bad karma Got a lot of that in Levita look, I just wanna let it all go Yeah, I can't say no when I'm this free Don't wanna go home or I can't sleep Weather's so nice, only got good vibes Yeah, we're here chillin', chillin' in paradise Sunny days, sunny days, sunny days No clouds in the sky, but I get away Feels like it's been a freaking decade Sorry, don't call me cause I'm gonna be on break Sunny days, sunny day, make way All the stress and doubt We actually had to screw the door shut for security purposes. We put everything on that side of the wall while this was getting built and we had stuff in there and a door that has no lock and easily accessible. So we actually ended up screwing the door frame to the door. So I've taken photos. I'm going to unscrew it, put it over there with the other ones that are going to go for sale and continue cleaning. Did you pack the flashlight, the blanket, and the mat? It's a real adventure, the trail you're looking at. I'm glad you came for a while, I thought you might be bailing. It's a shame, someone's actually painted the glass on that, but I'm sure if I can sell it on market. I want it gone, I sell it cheap. I'm talking like, you know, 20, 30 bucks, so potentially a 200 dollar door because it is an old Queenslander, they have more value to them, and she is solid, but I just want it gone. I want the stuff out of here, so I sell things cheap to make it move. Five minutes until the dog needs to go to the dog room. I'm gonna try and finish demoing that wall. I can't find my mask, but there's no more gyp rock. That's just cement sheeting. And I can usually get that out in one big piece. So I'll give that a few whacks. And then we can take out some of the studs. And then I'll do a clean up until I literally have to let him stud the doors out.
Now, we have had builders out, engineers out, draftsmen out, uh, and asbestos people. So the cement sheeting is just cladding, asbestos free. We do know that this wall here, um, it's not a structural wall, but these poles are structural. There's still beams that go down. There's one, two, three, four steel beams that go down. So I can take out all of the frame work, but the steel beams can't. The steel beams are actually holding up these that go across the house. So that is where we had to get an engineer to redesign how we can do the roof with taking them out. So we're not touching those. I just want to get all of the timber stuff out. So at least we have like bigger openings um, and we can kind of visualize the space a bit more. We have plans drawn up, but I'm one of those people that like to like mark it out and physically like stand the room and go, is this a good size laundry? Can I put baskets there, washing machine, sink, toilet and get a feel, not just look at a plan. I just want to go through a tape and tape out our measurements. So you got to think why are their poles still there? I can't take those out. Well, I could, but the house would fall down. I'm gonna do a quick cleanup of the floor. That's my dog at the front, it's not. So I'm gonna get all this area here cleaned up. I then take my dog to the dog groomer to get her claws and hair done. And I'll call it a day. Cause I still have two children that I have to mother to. <laughs> 